This episode of Techzilla is sponsored by Carbonite. It's been nuts around here today. Windows 8.1 preview dropped this morning. I like to think of it as the return of the start button. Um, you know, there's basically, if you want it, uh, windows.microsoft.com slash en dash us slash windows dash eight slash preview. That just rolls right off the tongue, doesn't it, kids? Uh, click over to download. You cannot download the full ISO files yet. Obviously, ISO files are not yet available. What you do download is a small installation application. You install that. It will download the files. You need to upgrade it. We've got a couple questions on Twitter. It does not seem, you know, it's obviously it's not doing a clean install because I've got Chrome. I've got Norton anti-theft. I didn't install that. It came spree installed from Toshiba. <laughs> I Skype, obviously. So it's not erasing your existing files in this particular version if you up Date it from within Windows 8. So, what's the whole point of Windows 8.1? Well, one of the biggest things is, is right down here in the corner, there's a start button. Awesome. Yeah, and it's kind of interesting, right? So, uh, you're not getting the, the crazy sort of nested menu action that you're worked to. It will call up the start screen, or you can look at things like this and pull up programs and features and start organizing things. Um, it's a, it's, you know, basically what they want to do is give you the start button functionality of the Windows 8 aesthetic. Uh, the snap view will give you up to eight apps side by side. If you have dual 2560 by 1600 monitors, smaller screens are still going to have two applications simultaneously max. Oh. Uh, independent scaling for multiple monitors. Cool. Yeah, it's about time actually. As someone who uses multiple monitors in multiple configurations, that's a good thing. And I'm, I'm really hoping at one point they're going to really fix the DPI for all applications and make it so <laughs> that everything can scale perfectly at some point in yeah. the near future. So but it's, it's a good thing. Anything they, to make that better, I'm all for it. Um, improved search, which I haven't had a chance to play with yet, uh, and some more stuff, basically integrating more of Microsoft's infrastructure into Windows 8. Um, should you be downloading it? That was another Twitter question we got. Uh, well, you have to have the 8. You have to have the original 8 installed already before you can apply 8.1's upgrade. Am I incorrect right. on that? So if you're not already using it, it would be a hassle probably to get started from scratch. Until the ISO comes out and you can right. do a clean install of 8.1, you're stuck doing the upgrade path currently. So, but that should change in the next few days. Yeah, I, and I'll be honest with you. If it's your, I, this is what I say with pretty much every beta. If it's your production machine, if it's the machine you use to make your living, I would just install it on a separate partition. I would install it on a virtual machine. I would install it on a secondary machine. This is not the machine I make my living with. Yes. This is, you know, so I am okay with running beta software on that. If like, and if, if you're using certain USB TTL adapters for your Raspberry Pi, they probably won't work in Windows 8 either. Let me just tell you that right now. <laughs> You know, because that's... Uh, personal, personal pain. You're crazy. I am. You're still upset about that. I am. Well, that, no, yeah. What's something you're not upset about? No. What's coming up next? No, Leap Motion, folks. We are going to take a look at one very cool peripheral that you can add to a computer that's coming soon that's going to provide a pretty wonderful way to use your digits as a way to control software and the interface itself. But first, we're going to take this moment to thank one of our sponsors. Don't lose your important documents because you didn't take the time to set up a proper backup plan. Carbonite Online Backup is automatic cloud backup for the computer files at your home office or small business. Just set it up once and Carbonite will protect your computer files so that you can stay focused on running your business. No hardware required. With Carbonite, getting your lost files back is easy. Your employees can even access their backed up files on their smartphone or iPad with a free Carbonite app. Carbonite is the better backup plan for your home office or small business. Start your free trial at Carbonite.com with the offer code TECHZILLA today. And you get two bonus months if you decide to buy. That's Carbonite.com, and the offer code for two bonus months is TECHZILLA.